Hey there, friends and video game fans. I'm not sure uh, when we lost recording. Huh. Delta oh. 3 chamber active. Tissue and vital function check. Error. Disruption detected. Restart. Emergency nanotrite activation launch. Nanotrite? <laughs> Two. Oh my god. Awaken. This was totally making me think of rage. <laughs> okay. I got blood on my Wednesday, knuckles. September 7th. <sighs> 2045, day oh. 178 from the beginning of the hibernation. Critical state of health detected. Okay. Alright. Let's see what's going on here. Okay, you guys. Now, um... Okay. Interesting. Space to interact with objects. That's weird. I don't like that. I like my space to be jumped. You know what? Okay. Electromagnetic stun gun. A thousand volts at a single shot. Okay, we have iron sights. What was that? What is devastation? Uh. Okay. Does that does that have charges? Service room. We got some money. Okay. This game is weird, man. Come on, give me some enemies. I want to get to the fighting. Wait, wait. Did I just backtrack? Oh crap. I, uh, I could have sworn I was going to a new area, but I recognized that corpse there. Oh, hey. Got some more money. $500. With the dollar sign at the end of the thing. So that means... Access denied. Exit door lock. That means that it's the future. Uh-oh. Oh, Hello? that's the scream what's we heard. Look, <laughs> yeah, let's ask them what's going on. Hey, are you guys trying to help? Are you guys trying to help that guy? Or is that a girl? Yeah! Oh, yeah! Yeah! Get a pistol. That's my objective in real life, baby. Okay, so he... He makes us swivel 180 degrees. That's so weird. What happened here? It's like the guys who made this have never played a WASD game. Like, ever. It's so weird. Okay, well, I guess we'll go here. No! No! Hold the door! Alright. We got ourselves a magnum. We got ourselves some iron sights. You guys are gonna stay down, right? I hope so. Whoa, god damn, this mouse is so sensitive. I have a feeling that's gonna come in handy though. Like, who needs who needs a, a 180 spin though? When uh oh boy. Ah, uh, story shit. I'm not in the mood. I'm sorry if that was interesting to you guys. But I mean like the mouse this sensitive, like, dude. I can spin 180 degrees by moving the mouse about, I'd say about a quarter inch. I can't really tell if I have mouse acceleration on. I would think that developers today would know better by now than to have mouse acceleration active in a game, but this is so sensitive. Warning. Automatic defense activated. Warning. A 
So iron sights are almost totally impractical and useless. Holy shit. Wow. <laughs> this is something. How do I crouch? Because <laughs> when they're crawling, they're actually a little harder to hit. <laughs> okay. This is, um... Interesting. It seems like they're kind of go trying to go for that, like, survival, well, like, that kind of, uh, desperate, lonely feel that, like, Soma had, you know? Although, obviously, it's in a, an action, zombie, uh, action survival game. Oh my god, what the fuck? Oh, I missed with that shit? Okay. I thought I was gonna have a shotgun for the start. So... That's kind of disappointing. Uh... Oh my god. This guy... Hazmat suits, man. Why did we decide to make them bulletproof? The hitboxes seem kind of weird. Oh yeah, do the Jesus on the cross for me before I shoot your head off. Okay. Well, you know what? That was something. Oh, okay. Oh, ooh, you almost got me there, buddy. Yeah, that you didn't like that much though, did you? Alright, well, you know, you know, I, I'm, I'm definitely not interested in the story. Uh, let's see what that does. Alright, that's pretty sexy. I dig. You know, let's quit, though. Go back to the menu, and uh, I noticed some other game modes here. So, survival sounds interesting. Oh, really? Okay, so it looks like I actually have to get through the story mode. What about missions? Nah. Oh, that's a disappointment. Don't suppose there's any multiplayer on this, huh? No. Oh. Well, that's really a shame because I have to say I'm already bored of this. As uh, as cool as this game seems, it's just not holding my attention for some reason. I don't know, the combat's kind of slow paced, the kills are definitely not satisfying. Um, I can definitely see what they're trying to do. The mood? Uh, it isn't landing for some reason, though, because the opening is just very much like, like Soma or like um, Rage, or what other games like, uh, you know, well, how many how many survival games start like this where you wake up somewhere, you know, it, it's it's fucking Rick Grimes, <laughs> it's um definitely a common trope, but I, I think I'm digressing. I don't know. I just didn't really enjoy the combat very much. The controls seemed kind of clunky. Um, the kills, again, were not very satisfying. The, the weapons did not give me a lot of satisfaction to use. So, um, no, I don't think I'm going to be playing this again. I really did not feel interested in the story because I, I don't know, there was nothing to, to make me care about these characters. I, it's, what can you say? You wake up in a stasis chamber in an abandoned space station and I, I've seen it so many times that I, I, I don't have to try and find out why. I can already guess. Or I just don't care. But, um... 
a good action game doesn't need... Well, I'd say, yeah, a good action game. I was gonna say, well, I take that back, a great action game. But no, a good action game doesn't need a, an interesting story. Take Turok, for example. But, uh, I don't know. Whatever it is, this, this just doesn't have it. And I, I don't feel like coming back to it. So that's it. Uh, I'm gonna leave this one here. Thanks for watching, you guys. Uh, my name's Head Got Shanked, and the game is Dead Effect. And, uh, hope you have a good night.